So the game I'm playing today is called Carol Blaster. This is a pixelated 2D run-and-gun game, a genre that I don't really cover that often on my channel. Maybe I should make an effort to change that. In this game, you play as an anthropomorphic frog with a giant-ass bazooka that shoots lasers. You work for a company. I'm not sure what kind of company it is, because I, I know pretty much nothing about this game, and the game's description on Steam is pretty vague with its wording. But basically, there's a bunch of teleporters set up in your company's offices, and they're going completely haywire. And it seems like the cause of the malfunctions is due to some mysterious black creatures, because I guess the developer decided to go the whole Shadow the Hedgehog route of, of naming the, the enemies. And you have to put a stop to it. Why it has to be you exactly, I'm not sure why. I haven't played this game off-screen at all, aside from, uh, just running around this uh, office room right here trying to learn the controls. It tells you the controls at the very bottom. You move left by pressing the left arrow key, move right with the right arrow key, look up with the up arrow, you can jump with the Z key, and shoot with the X key. Now this game was originally released in 2014. It was not available on Steam initially. This was finally brought to Steam about a year and a half after its release. It was met with relatively little fanfare, although this game was developed by a pretty prominent indie dev. This this was developed by Studio Pixel, the same person responsible for developing Cave Story. Cave Story being one of the most iconic indie games of all time, and one of the games that pioneered the Metroidvania genre. So this is Studio Pixel's newest project, and I don't really know anything else about it, so how's about we, we just get started here? I'm gonna unpause the game, because if I didn't have it paused, this phone would have kept ringing on and on. For, for like the, the past two or three minutes that I've been talking for. So I do know that you can shoot with the X key. You can just hold down the X key to uh, continuously fire. And I guess you have uh, infinite ammo, essentially. So you can fire upwards, fire left and right. You can also jump. One thing I notice is that if you just lightly tap the Z key, you perform a tiny jump. If you hold it down, you can perform a much longer jump. And you are kind of floaty. If you hold down the Z key and then move around, as you can see, uh, gra gravity appears to be uh, a l kind of weak in this game. Sort of. You can also uh, move up ladders. The way you do that is by pressing the up arrow key when you're standing underneath a ladder, and then you can just uh, walk up the ladder, because you don't you don't actually climb it. You can still uh, look left and right while doing that, and you can even fire. Uh, yeah, you can also fire upwards while climbing up the ladder, or walking up the ladder as well. Uh, I already eradicated all the enemies in this, uh, screen. There were some enemies that I had to kill before, uh, the phone would actually begin ringing, but I've already- I've already taken care of them, so I do know- I do know exactly how this game works, so we're gonna answer this phone. Just shut up, holy crap. Okay. Select save data to continue. Well, I'll do just that then. I'll- I'll select this one. Start the game using this data. Yes, that is- that is fine. Is it your first time to play Carol Blaster? Yes, but is is this is this gonna take me to like a, a very long intro that I'd rather or a very long tutorial that I'd rather not play? I'll just say yes anyway. I hope you have fun. Oh, okay, that's oh. Hello. Um Hi hi boys. The, the welcoming committee has arrived. Okay, fine then. You 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 just get away, please. You just go away. Okay, are these guys actually not gonna not gonna attack me? I mean the, they didn't attack me uh when I was fighting them off screen. Uh, well, I think the only ones that are, like, the ones that are stuck on top of the wall, I think if I, uh, if I shoot them, then they'll fall down and they'll start moving all over the place. Unfortunately, you can't shoot, uh, downwards, which is, uh, kind of, kind of unfortunate. Like, when you're jumping, and then when you, uh, when you try to press the down arrow, it, it doesn't do anything, so that's kind of unfortunate. Yeah, see, this guy, this guy falls down right here, and then he starts moving around all over the place, but then he just, he just kind of leaves. It just leaves you alone. So we had we had to answer the phone in order to create a save file, and then we had to answer it again in order to start the actual game. Okay, that doesn't make a lot of sense, but whatever. Cat and Frog Inc. Oh, this music though. I'm not sure what kind of alien language that is, but you are a cat, so um, she she's yelling at me. Okay, she is definitely yelling at me. She's she's pissed about something. All right. Well, I'll do whatever it is you, you told me to. The president is angry again, huh? Recently, we've had nothing but trouble. Must be getting to her. Alright, well, I got my big-ass bazooka. Am I gonna go and kill some fools? Good luck on the job! Alright, well, there's this teleporter. It's gonna take me on to the, to the mainland. What exactly is his job again? His job? Hmm. 
Custodial Sciences. Interland Fort. Oh, I have a lives counter in this game. Okay. Well, that's, that's fine. That's fine. Just like the running guns. Okay. Um, I, I do believe there are different weapons that you can uh, collect later on in the game, though. If there is if there is one thing I know. Here we go. Just just keep keep moving and shooting. That's that's the entire point of these of these running gun games right here. Oh wait, can I can I actually like destroy their bullets? Okay, whatever. It doesn't doesn't matter. You're dead anyway. Just yeah, get out of here, please. Here we go. Destroy the destroy the tumbleweeds too. All right. So am I just am I just doing this for now? I'm just gonna keep keep moving to the right and and just holding down the X key. Okay, well, I'm gonna have to do something a little bit more complicated than that, it seems. Okay, there we go. What are what are these coins for, exactly? I have no idea. I don't know if, if there are things down here that, that hurt me at all. Uh, okay, well, I'm gonna assume that those things hurt me because I can destroy them. And they take, uh, a lot of, a lot of hits to kill. Okay. Well, this is interesting right now, but it doesn't seem that much of a challenge, because the only thing I've been doing so far is moving to the right and holding down the X key. Seems that's all I really have to do right now. Doesn't seem too complicated. Alright, well you're all dead. Is that it for the first stage, or is there another scene? Okay, no, there is another scene. Uh, this looks shady. This looks really shady. I don't like the way this, this looks. Okay, you, you jump. You jump a lot. Uh, okay, move, move out of the way. Try, try to actually make an attempt to avoid, to avoid projectiles here, which I seem to have, a uh, trouble doing in these kinds of games. That's a heart piece. Uh... I don't think there was any any point to me getting that because I don't think that uh, replenished my health at all because I only have two hearts of health. Maybe later on I'll be able I'll be able to get more health, perhaps. Be able to get like a, a permanent health increase. That would be good. Maybe I can maybe I can use the coins for like purchasing upgrades or something. Uh, I don't know if I can jump up there, but there is a, a chest that I would like to collect. Okay, actually there is. Hang on a second. This ladder. Let me just go and destroy these these little spikes here. I'm not I'm not gonna jump into them to in order to find out if they actually hurt me or not. Here, open up the chest, please. What do I have? A bunch of coins. Okay. Good 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 treasure. Good good pull. Good haul. <laughs> just just move on to the to the next scene here. Okay, we we'll just make sure I don't get I don't get destroyed by this. See ya. Oh, okay. So this this must be uh, where I can upgrade the weapon shop. Okay, yeah. Which weapon would you like to see? Uh, the the pea shooter. Okay, yeah. So I can uh, I can upgrade it. I can upgrade it to a repeater. Allows you to shoot farther. It's a start at least. Yeah, sure. Powered up. Your pea shooter was powered up to a repeater. Oh, this must be where I can get where I can get more health. Um, hard boost, hard jar, one up. Uh, geez, the one ups are are really expensive. Uh, hard boost. Probably allows me to get more, uh, more health. Maybe it's a permanent health increase. Uh, this will fully replenish your gauge while my gauge is already, is already full. Let's just check this. Increase your total heart count by one. Okay, yeah. That, that would be useful, but I don't have, uh, I don't have enough coins for that. Automatically replenish four hearts when you lose your last heart. That's the heart jar. And the one-up, this will increase your, your frog total by one. Alright. So there is, there is an upgrade screen here, it seems. Now, how, how do I get out of this? How do I get out of this screen exactly? No, no thanks. I, I'd like to, I'd like to go, please. Is, is there any way? Oh, here we go. See ya. Alright. Just, just get out of here then. Because I, I don't have any, any more money to, okay, no, I don't want to go back in. Please, get, get out of here. Okay, do I just enter them automatically? Okay, yeah, I do enter the the upgrade stores automatically. Not really a fan of that. I prefer to be able to do that manually, if if, if you don't mind. Uh, let me just let me just go and break this. Okay, now we're now we're doing double damage. We're doing we're doing two points of damage with every with every hit now. Oh wow, it flies a lot further. Okay, I'm a fan. I'm a fan. I'm not a fan of these of these crabs though, because they're just they're just like flying all over the place. Here, get it, get out of here, please. Get out of here. It does seem like I can actually destroy their bullets. Alright, there we go. Get get out of here. Get out of here. I do wish I could I could like aim downwards. What are you? What exactly are you? Do I just jump over you? I think I will just jump over you. Yeah, you're you're a snake. Well, you're you're done. You're a weak ass snake. Get out of here. Oh, okay, you're buried in the ground. That's that's why I can't hit you. Well, come on. Come on out. Come on out. I see you right there. Okay, maybe just jump over him. Fine then. Oh, cause he was he was uh, oriented the other way. That's why he didn't see me. 
Let's get this pointless heart. Sure. Uh, I'll jump over this. See, it seems a lot better to just to just jump over it. There we go. At least get some coins right here. I mean, I could go back to uh, to the upgrade store in order to uh, to get that additional heart now, but I think I'll just wait until I get to the next area. Um, not really too much of a challenge right now. I mean, am I really expecting that much of a challenge from the first stage? I mean, let's 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 be fair here. Oh, geez. Okay, hang on a second. Okay, that actually didn't hit me. I thought we had like a, a bit of a mini boss here. Uh, orient myself. Here we go. Uh, not don't look up, please. Okay, yeah. So I can I can destroy their bullets. It just it just destroys them like instantly. Yeah. Hi. How are you doing? Get out of here. Go away. Okay. I need to get to like to the bottom right here. Fine. I'll go I'll go over this way. Take him out from from the side. Uh, actually, there is a chest down there. Uh, is there any way I can get to it though? I'm not sure. Can I? Oh yeah, there's a secret passageway. All right, more more coins. Thank you. Raking in all the dough. Raking in all the moolah. Probably more more money than my than the president pays me. Okay, hang on a second. I'm I'm actually about to die here. So hold on, hold on. I need to I need to play this to save just a, just a little bit. Okay, I think I think we're fine. I think we're fine. Just get all this crap out of here. Yeah, so it takes away one heart of health every single time I get hit. Okay, maybe this will actually be a bit of a challenge here. Here, just... You go away. You go away, please. Another tumbleweed? Okay, I can just kill the tumbleweeds, like, instantly now. Um, I mean, it did save. So I'm gonna assume that, uh, if I, if I do die, I could probably just start from, from this screen. Or I can restart from the screen. Actually, this was, like, the entire screen right here. Okay. Now I assume we're coming to a mini-boss, because there's no music, and everything has gone incredibly sinister as a result. Okay, yeah, here we go. Oh god, how am I gonna do this with just- with just one- with just two hearts of health? Hi. You're- you're a giant- a giant plant creature. You're- you're terrifying. Holy crap. Hi. Well, actually... If I can just destroy these things, like, instantly, then this might actually not be- not be that big of an issue. Only problem is that these things bounce all over the place. Yeah, hi. Hi. Oh, jeez. Oh, wow. Okay, just jump. Jump over, please. Okay, actually, this this doesn't seem too bad, guys. Cause cause my repeater has like so much range on it anyway. So I can just I can just I can just like stay over here and just and just constantly hit him. Okay, now he's getting mad. He's getting mad, boys. Oh boy. Oh wow. Okay. Now I now I'm not gonna be able to see where that's going. Oh, go away. Well, actually, I can shoot upwards. What am I doing? Get get rid of him. Get rid of him. Hurry up. Oh, good God. Oh, jeez. Oh, please. Oh, please, mama. Oh, please, mama. Oh, kill him all. There we go. He's done. I mean, I didn't get hit. So at least it wasn't- I, I didn't- I didn't suck. I haven't died yet. So that's- that's a plus, at least. Usually, I die within the first five minutes in these games. Features a widespread, so it's easier to hit enemies. Retains its power underwater. Okay. Got a fan. I thought I thought there was some bad English there for a moment. That's why I hesitated. I'm like a wide a widespread. That that's okay. Wow, actually. Okay, that's that's cool. I'm I'm a fan of that. Doesn't have a a great rate of fire, unlike the repeater, but it's okay. If as long as it can do more damage, I'm okay with it. Okay, I probably have to kill this guy on on the side right here. Huh. So I guess I guess the ones in the background I can't actually hit. All right, take me up, beam me up, Scotty. Cannon frogging. Wait, did you change? I'm pretty sure you're you're like larger now, and she's she's yelling at me even louder. Is that a snake? See, not e not even the frog understands what the hell she's saying. President's still in a bad mood, huh? Maybe finish cleaning up the transport devices, she will cheer up. Here, take this. A heart jar. This item will automatically replenish four hearts when you lose your last heart. Okay, I just get this automatically then. That's all you get for travel allowance. Where's he going next? Um, next is a place with a lot of greenery. So I'll, j I'll blend right in. I can, I can use camouflage here. Watch out for mosquitoes. Alright. I'll take- I'll take your advice then. Greenery zone. Well, it's, uh... It's green. 
kind of, well, not, not fully, like, there's a little bit of purple and pink here as well, but, yeah, sure, whatever, not, not, not gonna argue with it, I'm not gonna be petty about it, oh, I can also destroy all the, all the shrubbery too, so let's go, let's go and destroy nature then, I guess, I mean, I am a frog, I could probably, like, swim in the water just fine, right, yeah, that doesn't, that doesn't hurt me, I don't know if I can drown in it though, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna try it though, Okay, yeah, it seems like even when these guys are buried in the ground, the fan can still hit them. Uh, oh, jump! There we go. Jump over the logs. Just jump over the logs. That fish is probably gonna, yeah, I could have, could have figured you were gonna, you were gonna pull, pull something weird on me. How you doing? You just jump out of the ocean, just like, just like the fish in Sonic. So it's not, it's not entirely a, an original character. Uh. Let me chain my blaster. Yeah, because I can hit you from all the way over here. I can't destroy that, though. So I'll just jump over that. Here we go. There we go. I'm here. I'm here. I'm okay, boys. I'm okay, boys and girls. Oh, wow. Okay, yeah, that that can collide with, uh, with the rest of the ground. Here, just get all these annoying fish out of here. I'll just jump over this. There we go. Good thing I have a, a, very, a very floaty jump. Here, come out of the water. Thank you very much. Get out of here. There, grab the coin in midair. Uh, what are you, exactly? It went until your back is turned? Get out of here. Well, I mean, you you died instantly, so it, I, I didn't even get to see what ex what exactly your concept was. Alright. Well, these guys... Yeah, these guys just, like, just like die instantly. Okay, fine then. They're just more of an annoyance. Okay, that's a bird. That's a bird. I'm gonna try and get, and get the coins. Hi, how are you doing? Can I... Can I destroy you? I'm not sure, but, I mean, I got all the coins anyway, so I don't need to bother with you. I don't need to bother with your weird-looking ass. Please? Oh, okay, hang on. Hang on a moment. Guys? Can I- can I kill- can I kill you? I probably can, but, yeah, it just takes a lot of- takes a lot of hits. I'll go up this way. I'm not, I'm not sure if there was another path I could have taken down below, but whatever, I don't care. I don't care, I'm too- I'm too scared. I'm too scared right now. Okay, wow, hello. There's- there's birds all over the place. Okay, yeah, hang on a second, I can hit you. Okay, well, pfft. I guess I'm using my heart jar now. Okay, fine then. What in the world was that? How did I- how did I even jump through that? Please leave me alone. Oh, wow. Okay, I- I killed one of them, actually. There, I made it- I made it through. Oh, there's- there's- there's, like, quicksand here as well. Okay, okay, okay. I'm- I'm fine. I- I like- I like a heart, though. Maybe- maybe I should have taken the- the extra heart when I was- when I was back in there. When I was back in, like, the, the previous level. Uh, it's okay, though. It's okay. There's just bees. I can- I can kill the bees easily. Okay, I can't jump easily, though. That's- that's kind of difficult for me. Here. Flying to- flying to my- my line of sight. Cause you're- you're just that dumb. You're just that stupid. Here. Can I- can I reach you from here? Yes, I can. Okay. Now, we actually did make it to, uh, to the weapon shop. Okay. So what should I- what should I get here? What should I get? Do I upgrade my repeater? I cannot do that because I need 500 coins. That's not gonna happen then in that case. Uh, I can power up the fan though. Uh, sure. I'll power that up for now. And then I'll go over here. And I- I'm gonna get a heart boost. Because I need it. Good lord. Okay. Now can I get another one out of curiosity? Okay, no, I can't, because the next one need, requires 60. Okay. I think... I think we're fine for now. I don't think I'm able to, to purchase any more upgrades anyway. Yeah, look at this massive-looking fan. Okay. Very nice indeed, then. Let's just see... Okay, yeah, and all the enemies respawn, because of course they do. Although the range on this one is even worse, but as long as it does more damage, then, you know, doesn't matter to me. It's, it's fine with me. It is absolutely fine with me. Just get through through the murky death. I see you down there. Don't think I didn't see that. He, he didn't try anything, but I, I saw him, so I got out of the way. Okay, get this get the bee down below. There. Wreck him. There, just get get the coin. Because every every coin matters here. Okay, you you go away. Oh now he's now he's running. Yeah, hi. You can't jump up here, can you? No, you can't. So just stay down there. Stay down there. Yeah, troglodyte. Here, just kill the shrubbery. Cause I don't give a crap about nature. Oh wow! Instant wrecked. Instant annihilation. Okay, hang on a second. How many birds are there exactly? Please go go away. Holy crap. 
probably just gonna keep on coming. Okay, just just get this get this weapon. Then in that case, oh wow, go underneath. That guy didn't want to go underneath, and that's what happens. He he dies as a result. That's what happens when you don't go underneath. What is this now? Flying fireball? It doesn't matter because he's dead. Or is it a mud ball? I mean, he is like blue or or orange, but then he becomes blue when I attack him. That doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Turn around, please, so I can actually hit the guy. Okay, I guess he just does, he does just respawn over and over. So just stay stay there, stay there, please. Oh my God, there's there's more of them coming. Okay, hang on. The guy on top. And I can't. Well, I can jump he up here. But is there anything for me to see up here? Not really. Jump. Uh, oh geez, get out of the way. Get out of the way. I'm not even sure what what these guys do when I when I hit them, but I'm not gonna stay here to find out. All right, I think we're coming up to the boss already. I guess I'm gonna have to wait for this for this treasure chest then. All right. Well, let's go then. Let's let's go down into the swamp and just kill these little guys. Is 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 that all we have to kill? Hang on a second. Something something's fishy about this. It it just can't be the tiny enemies. No, I I could have figured. I could have. Oh wow. Okay. You're you're charging at me. You're charging at me with a head of steam. Oh. But I got the jumps, though. I've got the pro jumps. Oh, good god. He, he's, like, backed me into a corner. Hang on a second. Whoa. Hello. Get rid of the other guy, too. Okay, hang on a second. I think he- I think he is targeting me directly. Okay, I didn't- I didn't- I didn't- I jumped a little bit, uh, too late there. Hang on a second. You don't- you don't phase me at all. Wow, okay. I'm really timing my jumps, like, horribly. Okay, hang on a second. Doesn't matter. You're almost dead anyway. Okay, well, I'm dead now. Of course, when he has just one one heart of health remaining. There we go. You're you're done. I just ran into him and he exploded. Because that's how OP I am. Nothing happened. You saw absolutely nothing. A bubble. Okay. These bullets roll forward for a long distance. They're also buoyant, so they've flown on water. This is going to become like Bubble Bobble now. Hang on, I want to try it. Can I try it, please? Ooh, okay. <laughs> that's cool. They, they, they bounce. They have, they have, they have physics. They have physics on them. Okay. I'm a fan. Oh, I collide with them too. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm definitely a fan of this. Uh, let me go and get the chest on the other side, please. I, I'd like to see what's, what's over here. Oh, I can blow up the chest with bubbles. That makes total sense. I, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah, you, you, yeah, you better just go and commit suicide. You better just run like a little coward. Not when I'm here. You, you're gonna, are you gonna stay alive? Here we go. Nothing's gonna stand in my way, cause now I'm just killing everything with bubbles. Such a, such a maniac. <laughs> what is going on with this cat lady? Why is she just getting larger and larger? She's like inflating. I don't know what that means. I still don't know what that means. Okay, there's a lot of them. Oh, she's spawning them. With her, with her words. This is like Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga. The president really is messed up, huh? Is the cleanup not going well? No, it's all on schedule. I see. Two more areas left in the quota. Wait, only two more areas? Don't bring us anything back. Wait a second, are there only like... four stages in total here? I... I don't understand. They only said two more areas. What do they mean by that? Are there only two more stages left? Right, well, in any event, I think I'm going to stop here anyway, guys, because I have been recording for quite a while. Not to mention, do you, do you guys remember the, uh, the, the storm that I talked about uh, in yesterday's video? I said there was going to be a, a pretty big storm that was that was going to hit my area within, within the next, like, 24 hours. Well, I'm actually recording this video during that storm right now, and it's not it's not bad right now, but I feel like it's gonna get a lot worse in just uh in, in just a short amount of time, so I think it would be uh best if I just stopped recording anyway. There, I'm just gonna <laughs> Jeez, I, I'm in love with this bubble gun, I really am. It's like all the bubbles are physics based. They they act like they act like balls, and it's it's so so strange, but I I still love it regardless. Can can I like jump on them out of curiosity. Like, can I place all of them in a corner right here and then, like, jump on them? No, it just seems like I, like I moved them around. Yeah, I'll probably play this, uh, more off-screen. I, I'm not sure what it meant by, by two areas left in the quota. 
does does that mean there's only like two areas remaining i don't know i mean i don't know how long this game is supposed to be but if there is only like two more stages left then that's kind of disappointing because i was hoping this would be a, a little bit longer but i mean I, i'm enjoying what what i'm seeing right now especially this bubble gun which i'm probably just gonna like abuse to no end but for now guys i think uh this will be my stopping point i'm gonna wrap things up here i wasn't planning on doing a full playthrough of this anyway just wanted to give my uh i guess you could say my first impressions of this game because i had never played this before so far i i'm enjoying it i i especially like like the music here of course the art style is something that i've that i've seen done a lot within within indie games although this one is uh, a little bit different though like even though it is pixelated it does have its own unique style it's kind of weird though because it's like th this game is like very it's supposed to be very reminiscent of nes titles as you could probably tell by the pixel art style but for some reason the frog you're playing as looks like something out of an atari 2600 game i don't know he just seems a little bit uh a little bit lower quality than than the rest of the game or even even the other characters like the other characters look look vastly more detailed than than he does or she does or it does i don't i don't know its gender i, I don't want to use the wrong pronoun i mean it, it's basically it, it's basically illegal to do that in canada now so uh i better watch my mouth then i i, I gotta be a i gotta be a good boy <laughs> <laughs> Gotta be a good boy here when 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 you're in Canada. Otherwise, I'll I'll, I'll probably I'll probably receive receive a fine. Look, I don't want to get political here or anything, but I don't don't you think it is a little bit ridiculous when it, when a country will literally threaten to fine you for for using the wrong pronoun? Like when you accidentally called someone someone a he when they're actually actually a woman? I mean, doesn't doesn't it sound a little bit uh, a little bit uh, retarded to you? <laughs> yeah, Canada Canada is, is is quite the silly country indeed, and Justin Trudeau is. Is, is quite the silly little man but anyway uh <laughs> if there's gonna be some people that are gonna get mad at that but anyway the point is carol blaster is a pretty awesome little indie game it was made by the same person who developed cave story i'm surprised it didn't receive as much fanfare as cave story because it, it doesn't seem like that many people are are aware of uh this game's existence in particular that's kind of unfortunate because what I've been- what I've seen so far, I actually very much like. Oh, I thought- I thought the other blasters can maybe influence the bubbles, perhaps. That doesn't seem to be the case. Let me- let me blast some bubbles over here. Oh no, they just- they just fly right through them, okay. That's disappointing. That's really disappointing indeed. But yet it's- it's so cool how they're all- they're all like physics-based. Anyway, I'll stop- I'll stop gushing over the- the bubbles now. If you want to purchase Carol Blaster, links in the description. There is also an iOS version of the game that came out, I think, the same time as the PC release. Jeez, I even- I even love the sound that it makes too. Like, listen to this- this little sound. I- I just love it so much. Oh my god. Best- best weapon in, in video game history. Anyway, uh, thank you guys for watching, as always, and I will see you in the next video I make. Later!